Good morning, boys and girls. This is Mrs. Mary, and I wanted to talk to you about a special community service project that Ms. Wallace and I are doing with our families. We've been thinking about the character tree and remembering the things that we've learned this year about empathy and kindness. We are thinking about all of the people who are out in our community who are still working. I know you keep hearing things like essential workers and essential businesses. Well, there's still a lot of people out there who are working to keep us safe, and we need to see if we can help them feel special at this time. So I know Mr. Mary was at Winco the other day, grocery shopping, and he said thank you to the lady who was helping him with his groceries, and she was so surprised. She said people have been kind of unkind and just trying to buy as much toilet paper as they can. And Mr. Mary just saying thank you was really meaningful to her. So we're working on making cards or posters for our families that, from our families that are for the essential workers in our community. So people like Winco workers, people who work at Walgreens, people who work at Rite Aid, or maybe at Papa Murphy's Pizza. Mrs. Mary knows I have a neighbor who works at 911 and she still goes to work every day. One of my neighbors is a nurse. We are making cards or posters to help these people. So James and I have been making posters. Yesterday, we made two beautiful cards with Pete the cat. The day before, we made cards that have a squirrel, just like gray squirrel from the character tree. We're going to write in the cards and say thank you for still working and keeping us safe, or thank you for working and making sure we have groceries every day. Mrs. Mary is going to also send a candy bar with her cards. You don't have to, but I was thinking about sending cookies. But at this time, I think that maybe sending homemade cookies isn't a good idea. So we're trying this. I know Mrs. Wallace's family has made posters and they are going to take them to Costco later today because Costco workers are still working. This project is an extension of what we've been doing in class with our thankful box. This is my thankful basket. I know you saw it in Dojo a couple weeks ago where we've been writing lots of things that we are thankful for. One of the things we can be thankful for is that we can still go to the grocery store, that we can still go to Costco, that we can go to the doctor if we need to. If your family has time, I would love it if you would go into the character tree and again watch some of the videos. My family watched the Mr. Rogers episode yesterday about kindness. There's a new one on for April called Jonas Salk, and he's the guy who made a vaccine for polio, which was a terrible disease many years ago. I know right now doctors are looking to make a vaccine to help us with the coronavirus. I hope that your family will get involved in our community service project. It's okay to only make one card, but it's also okay to make lots of cards. And I know that's what we're doing at our house.